Ahoy, fellas! Now I know what you're saying. Oh, haven't we seen this place enough? And also, why are you lying, man? So, um... I just wanted to show a couple extra stuff off, because I think that this is probably going to be an otherwise really short episode. So, for one, the Lucky Sword goes crazy, man. I haven't even been doing this that long, and I'm making bank. So, yeah, Lucky Sword for the freaking win. Also, the Legendary Armor is... They aren't kidding when they say it's called Legendary for a reason. This stuff is, like... I know that I was, like screaming everything at the screen t going through here the first time. The legendary armor makes it not bad. Also, yeah. Hidden shops. This is the Tasmanian sword. And this is what it does. Yeah, I don't actually have to sit on anything now. Also, it's so much quicker. Oh my gosh. That's, that's actually really convenient. I'm gonna stay as Lion Man just because I like his attack, but, like, that's some good shit right there. And there's a reason that I'm getting a bunch of money. I will reveal that shortly for another kind of secret thing. And I was debating not doing this because I wasn't sure how far along in whichever area it was gonna be, but I don't think it's gonna be that bad to have to or to try and get, so I will actually get the thing that I was thinking of getting. Because, why the hell not? It'll help me out. Because, again, I mean, I, I don't remember if I actually included this in my last episode, but I was literally right... Um, I ended the episode right before the dragon. And then I got my butt kicked like three times. So I don't want to do that, honestly. So I'm going to do pretty much as much prep as I can to have that not happen. Oop. Which also involves, of course, preserving boomerangs. I need to conserve my boomerangs. They're probably the greatest weapon in this game. Or a sub-weapon, I guess. Uh, also, I guess I should be so glad that I'm playing with a, an Xbox controller, because I've been playing a lot of Symphony of the Night. And <laughs> I, it, it's it's the kind of thing where I have to try a little bit to wrap my head around the controls, just because I'm not used to the the scheme that it's in, because it's in PlayStation scheme instead of Nintendo scheme, and I'm using a Nintendo controller to play it. Don't ask me how exactly, because uh, hey, <laughs> uh, trade secret, but um. Yeah, I... It, it, it fiddles with my head a little bit, sometimes. Just a little bit. I just realized I'm not using the right sword. That's why I don't have enough money yet. I'm not hitting things with the lucky sword. I swear the lucky sword is great. I get so much money. Like, everything drops... Every other enemy, I swear, drops a purse. Okay, this has not been a very good showcase of the Lucky Sword's abilities. But as a, 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 a greed player myself, this is good shit, trust me. Because by the time I get to where the important stuff is, I'm gonna have enough money to buy the important stuff. Like, more potions, and whatever the hell I want, really. I kind of forget, wasn't there... I think there was some, some like, wacky armor in a shop that I just completely passed by because I didn't need it. And again, I think I, I this would have been two episodes ago. I'm glad I did that because the, the legendary armor and the legendary sword are free. So, lucky me, right? And not just because I have the lucky sword. I'm just a great guy. Good things happen to good people. That's always the case. Yes siree. Which is why good things happen to me, because I'm a good person. In fact, you can tell that I'm a good person. It's a, The hallmark of that is how many good things happen to me. Also, I think I could get that chest now. I uh, I really hate to interject all of the, the uh, all of the uh, kind of not less important, but like not uh, okay, of course, it's just in here. Oh, 
Okay, well, like 300 more, you know. That's fine. <laughs> I had to have a mind to maybe edit, like, uh, trickin' low to your god into that. That'd be pretty funny, right? Top. And I'm gonna kill everything I can in the way. Okay, maybe not. Ah, shut up, pal. I will actually kill everything that I can on the way, because then I'll have enough money. It's all about the money, baby. And I think that almost gets me. And again, since this is just a, a loop, I can just do it until I get enough money. There we go. Yeah. Again, the power of the lucky sword. Guys, I'm rich. I'm literally rich. Oh, but I can't... Crap. I think I might have just kicked myself... Uh, might have just shot myself in the foot here. So one thing I forgot to mention, and I did this because I went all the way through the Damio Castle again from a couple episodes ago. Um, you can't go backwards in any of these places. You just actually cannot. It's impossible to go backwards. Which is just great. It's great for me. Because I really, really want to go backwards. I think I can leave from here. Yeah. Okay, so this is fine then. And now that I've swapped swords, because I don't really care about the money... I mean, I still care. But look at that. I'm still making money, guys. This is still perfectly fine. And I might have to switch over to Tasmanian just for the sake of becoming Hawkman so I can fly out of here or whatever. Ooh! Good hitbox moment. Okay. Whatever. Not a problem. Just get me out of here. Alright, see? Not even... Not even an issue. I would love to be healed, but I can just do that in town for free, so whatever. Off we go. And honestly, I have half a mind to just, like, see how quickly I can go through the, uh... The frickin'... The final castle. <laughs> um, I guess it's, what, the Cloud Castle or whatever? Uh, with the Tasmanian sword, just because you can switch characters. But I don't know that that's actually worth doing. Ah, whatever. I'm over here, I may as well. Yippee! Because it's cool. Okay, come on, dude. There we go. Yep, 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 yep. This is a miscellaneous episode now. I mean, I... That was worthwhile. And I said it might not be worthwhile. Oh, silly me, you know? Also, I think this might be kind of a shortcut to town. Kind of. It'd be interesting if I could, uh... Yeah, actually, I can. I don't need to do that. So, yeah, cool. Anyways. Yeah, I'm, this is kind of... Well, again, I mean, we were right at the dragon, so, you know what? I'm just gonna skip ahead to the, the part where... We're fighting the dragon. I didn't buy the shield. Okay, now I have the shield. I mean, I, I still don't have, like, a great amount of money, because I would prefer to buy more potions, but, uh... That's fine. I'm sure I will be perfectly fine. Yeah. And now we're back. So, yeah, I think... I honestly have half a mind to just do this whole thing as, as, uh, as not Hawkman, because I feel like Hawkman damage is kind of doo-doo feces. And I mean, the... <laughs> like, the, the mobility is not actually all that great. I don't know what it is about Hawkman, but it's just not actually good. Actually, I know exactly what it is. The whole point of Hawkman is to be mobile, right? But he's not very good. He's like clunky, kind of wacky, slow mobility, you know? So, yeah, I think I'll I'll trade in these hollow, brittle bones for big, big man, lion man physique. Some part of me just really wants to do that, so I'm going to do it. 
and we will see how it goes. Also, I really want to know, is there like a door over here? Because there was a door in the Damio castle that is how I got these two potions that I have, which kind of pissed me off a little bit, but that's fine. Ow. Also, this guy has a bad habit of just, like, picking you up and throwing you around. It's just something he does. Um, but, like, I don't know if I even really have to worry about him, to be honest. Okay, yes, I do. Well, okay, the, the funny th it's kind of funny that that doesn't happen as bad to Lion Man. Like, if your Hawkman in, the, in this guy decides to pick you up and, and take you to town, you're going to town, and there's nothing you can do about it. But, uh... This is kind of funny that that does not seem to be a, as much of a problem for Lion Man. But whatever. Uh, increased defense and increased damage is definitely helping me out here. Uh, that's not helping. I'm just gonna use up my items for no reason. Hell yeah. Guess I don't really need to do that. It was helpful there. I'll give, I'll grant myself that it was very helpful, actually, to be doing it there. Because then I didn't have to deal with, uh, the mum, the doo doo feces here. I think I will actually stick with arrows here. I know, okay, look, I know that I was complaining about the vampire dragon. I didn't say it by name, but I was complaining about the vampire dragon, like, right earlier in this episode. This really isn't bad. Uh, I will grant that this is not bad at all, but I think it's, it really is just increased defense plus Lion Man damage. I feel like Lion Man can tank getting hit by a freaking truck, you know? Again, Hawkman got his brittle bones and just... I would not want to have to pay for that guy's health insurance. Just, like, there's not much to be said about Hawkman's resiliency. <laughs> so, yeah, no wonder... Big Cat has the floor here. I think I think it's gonna all turn out fine. Also, I think it's one of the funnier things about this. You can only hit the dragon on the head. You can only damage a dragon by hitting it on the head, typically. Um, I thought it was personally thought it was really funny that since there's a freaking face on its stomach, the stomach counts. I'm glad that's the case, because this was the Hawkman fight. But, you know, I didn't do it as a Hawkman, so... Honestly, I'm glad that I bought the Tasmanian Sword. Damn, I can't be... I can't be Lion Man anymore? But... But what am I gonna be? Please don't tell me that the human form goes away, just because I wasn't Hawkman before. Who? I'm Man Man! Just kidding, I'm Human. Whatever. How about that, guys? Have we even seen the town at night? I think we've only seen daytime town so far. Am I gonna see the nurse? Oh, darn. Well, that's alright. I'm also... I'm not... I'm not touching anything right now. The game is just doing this. So, cool. We made it! I'm not cursed anymore! The long battlefield journey has ended! Finally! Has finally ended! The tales of your gallant and heroic actions will be remade 20 years later in higher definition. Oh, okay. We'll be passed down from what? <laughs> uh, good night, brave warrior. Oh, jeez, I should take that as a signing off. Good night, monster land. Oh. I mean, it, it would definitely be kind of cringe for me to start saying that. I think I'm going to keep with, uh, you know threatening bodily injury and uh you know being annoying but yeah that's it that's the whole game i kind of knew this was going to be a finale <laughs> he's running on the ceiling yeah how about that guys honestly i think i was probably just whining like th there were parts of this game that i felt were kind of prohibitively difficult but i i think i really do think i was just whining and, again, Hawkman kind of sucks, but that's why you hold up throughout the entire game. And, um, if you're not holding up, then you'll miss out on secret doors. 
Original 1989 typos included. Nice! Where are the typos? Oh, let's see if I can find them. Fairy isn't actually spelled like that unless you're a, a fairy, as they say in... Um, uh, wow, that's a pretty young guy for a game designer. Dang! They had little boys working on this freaking game. What did you accomplish when you were 10? Wow. I gotta say, I... You know, with, with the way this game was balanced, I can believe it was made by 12 now. <laughs> <laughs> okay, he looks more than 12. I'll, I'll grant them that. Oh, nice. That's a, a nice, a swell-looking fellow. Okay. The art was well done. I'll give him that. I say that like I'm really going to detract anything from this game. It was pretty good. I liked it. It was it was short but sweet. And you know what? I got it for free, so it was definitely good value. <laughs> <laughs> um, but good times, good times. Uh, that, yeah, that's kind of all I really have to say about this game. It was, it was fun. It was fulfilling. Uh, it felt prohibitively difficult, and at, at times, and of course, all of the secret shops were maybe a little much. Um, but you know, that's that's secrets. I, I'm sure if I had the 89 issue of uh, Nintendo Power, I would have known about all those doors anyways. Just kidding, this was made by Sega. So, what, do I need the Sega Power? No. Um, but, uh, other than that, that's kind of it. Like, again, having, having all the quality of life and just the good items hidden behind Invisible doors sucks a little bit, but I mean hell it was what like piranha man That's the third guy and I I walked into one of those doors on accident So it's not like it's You kind of don't know you're there if you're playing the game You know without if you're playing well anyways if you're playing the game in a very honest manner I guess is how I would say it <laughs> But I never play platformers in an honest manner always looking for tricks so yeah it worked out it worked out in my favor this time I mean I still had to look up where the good stuff was and I didn't even get all the stuff but I mean I don't need all the stuff so uh, I'm not gonna show it to you <laughs> unless you really want me to seriously put it in the comments if you want me to find every single sword I think it might be a waste of time maybe but, you know, we will see, I suppose. It's not really for me to say that that's a waste of time. That's that's for the viewer to determine. Like how, I don't know, you can keep exploring as human. Nice. To what end? To, like, can I even actually do anything as human? I want to know. I Okay, I actually do kind of want to know. What can human do? I can't fly. Alright, and I can't... Alright. Okay, never mind. I have the Tasmanian sword, so I can still... I can I can still tell people to commit suicide, so that's nice. But, um, other than that, yeah, human can't do stuff. Oh? What's this all about? The unknown? Is this... Is this the, uh, the freaking... Please tell me that this is just the, uh, the, the Cuphead tutorial level. Okay, hold on. What is up with this? I mean, I could... Oh, actually, no, I can't. Tasmanian Sword is, uh, completely undone. Well, you know what? This was a, a fun game. Okay, oh. I'm gonna keep going. Why the hell not, right? Sheesh, dude. Alright. Whoever designed this, I'm gonna find you. Maybe. There's like, there's no good way to get back up. There is zero way. There's, there's not a good way to get back. You have to like, you have to have like godlike timing to get back up here. 
just because you're you're either getting hit by the fireball or you're accidentally touching one of these freaking moais on their on the top there. I guess they're gargoyles. The top, the, the tip of their chinny chin chin. That is a a terrible jump. All right, I figured out how to get back up to the beginning. That's great. Wonderful. It really is just like a, a corner freaking of the block thing. I, I, yeah, I jumped too late. I don't know if I'm even taking damage anymore. Okay, I am. I am still taking damage. Hey. Oh my gosh, I made it that time. Alright, this is like, this is definitely maybe like bonus episode territory, so I think I will just kind of like make this first jump and then dip. But, what a game. What a, a what a, what a bunch of time that I spent on this, you know? This is what, like five episodes? <laughs> Seriously though, the, the way back up, the way there is the hardest part. So I gotta, eh. I gotta make this freaking jump again. I have to. It's it's in my code. Also, getting hit knocks you back a bit. Even hitting something on the shield knocks you back a bit. I don't think I've gotten back up without getting hit by fireballs yet. There we go. Alright. Alright, I think what we do here is uh, just wait for these guys. Ah, loser. Actually, do we even have... I might just want to switch to legendary everything, just because there's no point in really uh, doing anything else. Alright, we're taking this guy out. We're taking this guy out immediately. Hold on. Ha, ah, loser. Oh, I guess I could have... Yeah, never mind. I feel a little bit silly about that. Kind of funny that they're all, like, golden. But, uh, okay. Nothing there? Alright, I have to actually run at this. Whee! That, that sucks. Alright, um... Okay, just had to hit it on the edge. Cool. I do wonder about, uh... What is supposed to be happening here. I mean, I, I really do feel like uh, I, tr I probably should just leave a lot of this off for... Is this gonna... Okay, that's pretty wacky. That is... that's a little whack. I was not expecting the, uh, basically, screen scroll. I did not mean to do that. I did not hit her. I did not. That's bullshit. Alright, well... Not for me. Oh, come on. Come on, man. Well, whatever. I mean, did I did I do my outro? Oh, okay. Well, little... Little, uh... Little, uh... Little, uh... Shortcut there. I really do have half a mind to just, um... I get the feeling I have to go up here. Aha! Okay, of course. I, uh, screwed that one up royally, huh? You know what? Yeah, it'll be an extra long series finale. And we'll get to fig get to the bottom of the mystery of the freaking This area. Also, I just love that the enemies respawn as the area reloads. Which makes sense. Don't get me wrong. But I, I don't have to like it, do I? Uh, okay, there I go. I did not commit. I should have committed. I have commitment issues. Don't tell anybody that because it's not actually true. Ah, yeah. At least you man doesn't take major damage like Hawkman does. I should be so glad that a uh, human man doesn't suck like his avian counterpart, the Hawk. Here we go. Of freaking co oh, of course I did I threaded the needle again ah <laughs> okay well I, I, again I'm in I'm in no danger of dying so I'm honestly pretty much fine with this area 
like I have I have no reason to really be upset with any of this. Because again, I'm in no danger of dying. It it sucks a little bit that I'm I'm kind of getting momentumed or whatever. Oh, okay, I might be in danger of dying now. Of course. Never mind, this area sucks. I hate it. I lied. I lied about this area being perfectly fine. I guess I didn't say anything like perfectly, but I did say that I wasn't going to be upset by it, so... Whatever, this is just bonus content anyways. Yippee! Also, did this guy seriously just like turn around and stare at me? I think he did. I think he was looking at me. What the heck? That's not cool, man. You can't just look at a man like that. Ow. Oy. I'm gonna go to the right. Alright, right was not the right answer. Ironically. I guess not ironically so much as like, funnily enough, you know? Are these guys stupid? I think they might be st I may be stupid! Ow. Oh my gosh. I got him. I got him out of sync. And now they're... Also, fun little fact about the ninjas. They don't they don't shoot after they've been hit. I think it's pretty cool. And I'm glad that that's the case. Okay, well, how in the heck am I supposed to do this? Can I crawl or something? Oh my gosh, that's clever. That's clever. <laughs> That's pretty funny. <laughs> what do I get for this? Jack Deadly Squat? Stone? Wow. That's... That's cool. I guess. I mean, it's not like I can actually get out of here now. Oh, so... What do I do now, huh? I guess I can... Slide in, sort of. But I have to really get the timing on this right, because otherwise I'm just going to get knocked back by uh, the knockback from the shield. So, uh, damn. It's really tight, guys. It's really tight. Oh, come on. Come on, guys. All right, yeah, I think I might have had it there. It's like you can't you can't afford to lose any momentum, and you can't afford to be a, a second late on the crouch, because otherwise you don't slide all the way through, and then you really have to nail it to get out of there, because otherwise you're just gonna get hit by the fireball, and then you're gonna get knocked back. There we go. I'm getting the heck out of here. I don't care what you ninjas say. Ninjas, by the way. Ninjas. As in N-I-N-G-A-S. Okay, how do I get the heck out of this place? Again, Tasmanian Sword doesn't work. Right? Or was I just on the wrong one? Yeah, Tasmanian Sword doesn't work. So... It's kind of weird that this place exists. And again, I'm still here. Haha, uh -huh, right? I mean, I guess I go down here, right? To get back up to the top. Whee! I found a stone! Isn't that cool, guys? I found a stone! I found a rock! Sorry. <clears throat> I got a rock. Isn't that rad? I guess this is a good place to, like, farm sub-weapons. But other than that, like, what am I here for? Ow. Die! There we go. Good times. Oh, and now everybody's favorite part. I get to do this again. Hold on. Aha! Hey! It's all about getting hit by stuff, you know, backwards. Good times, truly. And, you know, one more visit to the sexy nurse. You're really charging me now? <sighs> Fine. 
It's only because she's so attractive. Uh, well, that's kind of it. That's the whole game as far as I can tell. Maybe I'll talk to this guy again. Hey, what's up, guy? They would, uh, it would have taken more than a few charm stones to... Oh, right. Right. Charm stones. I'm going to have to look up what those are for. Because I don't actually remember... I don't remember... Th I didn't remember what the charm stones were for. That's what they are. That's what those things are. They're stones. They're charm stones. And I think you get something from getting them all or whatever. I don't know where they are, though, and I don't know if I really care. So maybe we'll find out on the next episode. But I'll probably just be playing something else. Still then, like, comment, and subscribe. Or I'm going to take all of your money. Goodbye! Yeah, I hope that one. I thought it was pretty funny.